There's no greater responsibility for us as parents, a society, than the protection, health, and safety of our children. And that includes the mental health of our children. In the state of Wisconsin, the next five years, we will be short 1,500 mental health practitioners who provide incredible services to our youth in our schools. And as the gentleman lady from the 14th said, and thank you so much for your comments, ma'am. Uh, as, <clears throat> as was mentioned, there are no giant silver bullets to address all the issues that uh, exist as it relates to mental health, both society at large or in our schools, but this is one. Uh, with this bill, we'll be able to provide access for our children, increased options for mental health services by having marriage and family therapists part of the solution, engaging in uh, so, uh, interactions with our kids to ensure that some of their needs from a mental health perspective are being met. When we have a workforce shortage and sometimes a funding shortage, it's important that we be creative with our solutions. And this is exactly that. Without having a fiscal impact and without creating additional uh, programs for workforce, we're able to move marriage and family therapists into a part of the occupation and a part of the space where they need the most, which is our schools. So I do want to thank the chair uh, of the committee as well as members on both sides of the aisle for working with me to make this a better bill, getting it to a bipartisan bill, and look forward to your support. Thank you.